I moved to Portland uh, more or less permanently about four years ago and um, I ran a little space at ADX and ADX is a little petri dish of makers and shakers and thinkers and all kinds of stuff. I got a 10 by 10 space and all more free material than I could possibly ever hope for so it's just up to me to measure up. You know, I have no idea what they're going to look like when you start because it just depends on what kind of thing folks are throwing away. So I started looking for something to do with the scrap that would be, I don't know, eye-catching, a little artsy. Um, and I figured out a way to, to build a sphere out of it. And it took about 300 hours to build the first one. And, and when you're two-thirds of the way through, three-quarters of the way through one of these spheres, I can see it down in my mind. And basically, the scrap has been gathered and glued together in the initial stages. So I pretty much know what it's going to look like. And that's when the drudgery hits. That's when you got to come in and you got to just stand there and keep going and finish it up. But there's something about taking all that wood, all those little tiny pieces, and making them into something that's this big around. So I built some things that got some attention, and um, ultimately the mayor's office asked for a loan of a sphere. So there's a parade of people through this office every day. They stream through this office all day long on one piece of business or another. There are groups of school children coming here to tour City Hall, there are tourist groups, there are visitors from our sister cities. And so to be able to say, this is who Portland is with this particular piece of art will be a lot of fun and a great symbol of who we are now.